At this home, we're supposed to pick up two cushions that have pet urine on them, and there's nobody home. And so they said they would leave the cushions by the rear door. It's a beautiful home. The pets are notorious here for uh, damaging cushions, and we try to get to them within a day or two if possible. Here they are. Yep. Time to pick them up and go to work. So this is the Ross's cushions. Looks like there's two of them that are going to need some work. And there's a urine stain. I've pulled back the cover. It looks like I'll have to remove the cover and inject this. And then uh, extract it and let it dry and do the cover. So um, here I go. So for Mrs. Ross's kitchen, cushion, I'm sorry, uh, you can see that the dog urine has left a ring. That doesn't always come out. That's all, not always necessary to come out because we really just want it to tell us where the urine is. So we follow the profile of that ring with, with a needle, urine contamination treatment that's diluted. And here's how we do that. We, well, we Pretty obvious, I guess, what we're doing here. And then we just inject and then we extract. Urine gets down uh, not that far, but it can wick in a half an inch or so. So we just want to make sure that we're injecting. And as we inject, we do a pattern. You can see the um, the fact that this is a uh, down cushion, the down is showing through once it gets wet, as opposed to dry. It's a nice cushion. We've got it thoroughly injected. So now that we've got the uh, entire area that was uh, urine stained injected with uh, urine contamination treatment, of course it's diluted. Uh, we're now going to take about 15-20 minutes just to vacuum it all out. It leaves a residue of the uh, contamination treatment behind and it penetrates a little bit, but not a lot, but it's certainly enough to eliminate the problem with the cushion. So now we just extract it. And this will take a while and we'll come back in a moment. Now we're going to, uh, we've got the cover back on the cushion, and we're going to spray on the treatment, the urine contamination treatment on the fabric, and then extract it. Now that we've treated the cushion with the urine contamination treatment, we mix a solution of a ColorFast upholstery cleaner, and then put that on with a, uh, a clean mitt. The mixture has already been determined by the chemical company, and we use a, uh, a simple mitt that's been freshly cleaned. We wash and launder these whenever we use them so that they're always new. We just immerse it, and then we begin the process of cleaning the cushion, which we then extract. I thought I'd show you where the urine stain is. I think you can see it now in the fabric. When the fabric gets wet, it makes it you're seeing the, my camera right now. Let me move around here. When the camera, when the fabric gets wet, um, you can see stains on it better. And now we're trying to neutralize this in a color fashion. Through, and I'm just gently trying to work it in and then vacuum it out. Let's see how it turns out. This not only works in the uh, urine contamination treatment well, but it puts it in uniformly, and then we can vacuum the water off, extract it once it gets nice and, and clean. And I'll show you the extraction here. Which we then use to dry off the fabric.
You can sort of see where it's drier. And once we do all the cooking that way, we can uh, neutralize the urine, dry it, and get it back to our customer.